you've been successful for a few years now. How do you, have you ever had a regular job? I worked at uh, I worked at Starbucks and FedEx, and oh my god, <laughs> horrible. Oh, uh, was it really bad? Uh, Starbucks was cool because I stole cheese danishes every day. <laughs> uh, FedEx was so depressing. It was just the spirit there, just older dudes like just pushing boxes, but okay with it. And it <laughs> it scared the living hell out of me. So I quit after a week and four days. You, how long did you work at Starbucks? Uh, two and a half years. And oh. this lady named Cindy, she was a new manager. She hated on me. And she fired me, and I hope she's watching, because I still hate her. <laughs> thank you so much. Cindy, huh? Thank you so much. I hate you, Cindy. <laughs> Is Cindy aware of your success? I hope, and I hope it... <laughs> Her firing me was the greatest moment of my life. Was it really? Oh, my change was free. Wow. How did she do it? She sit you down and say it's nah, time to go? Dude, somebody, one of the shift managers warned me like 10 minutes before she fired me, so I had nine minutes to call my mom asking her what I should do. Oh. Yeah, it was tight. I didn't even, like, somebody was like, yo, you're getting fired in nine minutes, boy. <laughs> and what did, you, what did your mom tell you to do? First, she was going to sue the star. She was going to sue Starbucks. <laughs> <laughs> then we figured out they did nothing wrong. So, <laughs> so uh, that's no reason that, not to sue. The phone, so, so, okay, that was nine minutes. That was, so I had about four minutes left to figure out what to do. So I manned up and said, all right, I'll get fired. And I ate like three cheese Danish. <laughs> You did the right thing. That's what I would have told you to do. <laughs> did you, were you a good employee there? I mean, I was... <laughs> Look, hey, I was nice. I was cool with people, man. I like talking to people. I didn't kiss ass to the people who worked there and the manager, and I think she found that intimidating. Also, I was the youngest there, so I, I had that attitude, like, worst come to worst, I could find another job, and I think she didn't like that. That's why she just... I see. Did you spell everyone's names right and get their orders correctly? I mean, that's the... Well, that's not even difficult. Like, just like, what's your name? If they say it and you can't hear it, you ask them again. And it's, it's not that complicated. Like, well, <laughs> sounds like you could have been... You could have done some employee training there. <laughs> to no, me. I would... I would have been the worst. I am Jimmy Kimmel. If you like that, subscribe to our YouTube channel to get all our latest videos before they die and go to YouTube heaven.